under K-12 education funding for 08, we are proposing the following changes and increases. First of all, ongoing 3% uh, general ed. It is the only mandated increase out of all of these that we are following through with. Uh, we will have a 16.9 million increase to meet that. Uh, teacher compensation program. Last year I proposed about three and a half million dollars in the teacher compensation program. Uh, I received no support from the education community. Uh, I talked to over 400 teachers at, uh, at a meeting uh, this year. They said they didn't know anything about it. They said they would have been in support of that program if they would have known about it. I'm going to try it again. I committed that I would. I'm putting four million dollars this year in the teacher compensation program that will be matched at some point. I'll talk more about it tomorrow. I'm not putting rules in place on it. I'm simply saying I want a plan put together to provide additional enhancement for salary policy for teachers, and I want them to work on projects with the dollars to show improvement in education, working towards goals of improving education within our school systems. And I want it to go to salary enhancement, primarily for classroom teachers. Uh, and I'll explain why a little bit more tomorrow. K-12 technology is still very, very important to us. We're putting $1.4 million additional into that. That's funding for the Digital Dakota Center. It's funding for the K-12 teacher and student email systems. And it's funding for the student information system uh, that needs to be completed. Uh, but that's $1.4 million. K-12 career and technical education programs. We started it uh, last year, and it's a million dollars. And I'm going to continue that program. State aid to special education. Uh, it's a 3% increase in per student funding for all disability levels, and an adjustment of funding for disability levels is required by statute every three years. The total increase under the general fund for education in this budget, K-12 education, is $24.3 million of the uh, $35.6 million that's in our proposal for general funds.